This video relates to the Earth-Moon-Sun lab activity on modeling the phases of the moon. You will need objects to represent the moon and sun and other materials to position these items appropriately. You will also need to be able to take photographs and record notes. For this example, I used a clip light to represent the sun and a three inch ball to represent the moon. The setup also used some tables in a darkened classroom. I attached the clip light to one end of a table. Then I supported the ball with some modeling clay and a pencil near the other end of the table. Here are three photographs showing the model from different sides. I will discuss each example in order from left to right. In the first or left photo, nearly the entire lit slide is visible. This is very close to a representation of the full moon. The second or middle photo shows half light and half shadow. The third photo shows mostly shadow with a thin strip of light. This is a representation of a crescent moon. When you complete your modeling activity, you will want to walk around and take photos to represent the entire cycle of lunar phases.